I'm going to tell you some basic and advanced ways to build buildings. So as in many other games, click on a constructor, click on one of these um, building tabs, click on a building, click on the map. That's how pretty much every game does it. Use the hotkeys if you want to be faster, which you should. And hold shift to queue some buildings. Um, so that was a bit tedious to shift all these buildings. What if I want to build a little line like this? You know, a nice wall. So what you can do actually is hold shift and drag. And then I've got a line of buildings. That's pretty good. Wind generators are a bit explosive though when they die, so I want to spread them out, which I can do with Z and X to spread out my buildings. Could even be useful for, say, some turrets, you know, that's a bit of a tight line. Let's hold it down. Yeah, that's a nicer line of turrets. So that's some nice simple ways to make some lines of buildings. There are other commands as well which are less useful, but they exist. You can make a box with Alt Shift, change the spacing like so. You can make a open box with Alt Shift and Control, which you know, it is what it is. It does this thing. You can make a nice little fence around a structure or even a unit with Control and Shift, and this is very flexible. So I can get this unit, make a bunch of those. I think you cannot change spacing though, you cannot change spacing. So that is all there is really for placing buildings in lines and stuff like that. If you want to rotate buildings, well you can press the left and right brackets or click and drag, which is really mostly useful for factories. See there's a big arrow on factories telling you which way they're going to be constructed in. If you want to terraform your buildings, well, let's just go over here. What you can do is select the building you want to build. So I want to make a lotus on a little tower. Hold down Alt, click the middle mouse button, then with Alt held, use the scroll wheel. And you can in fact queue these things. And I'll just deselect it. So now, the constructor is going to make a bit of terraform and then put a lotus on top quite useful for various things. You might want to, say, bury a caretaker to make it a bit safer. There's another way of doing this as well. If you don't like the alting and the hotkeys and all that, you can just select your turret, hold down the left mouse button for a bit, and then you've got this UI to select the height. And then you just place the command as so. So that's it for the basic buildings, but metal extractors, where you get metal, they're quite important. They're quite important, so they have a bit of their own UI. When you place a metal extractor, it snaps to these metal points because that's the only points on the map with metal. You can also just press this command or W to construct one like this with the left mouth mouse button. Or you can construct a bunch at once by clicking and dragging and it'll queue up a bunch of metal extractors. If you press F4 to toggle the economy mode, or this um, this button up here, you can right click and it makes a max. Or you can, no you can't right click and drag, but you can right click. Finally, for metal extractors, you can build little walls around them automatically. So press Alt and we've got a metal extractor with some solars around it, which is good for overdrive and also good for defending the extractor. So I can queue up a bunch of those. To finish it all off, you can hold Alt, give an order, and now I have all my metal extractors with solars around them. And that's really all there is to it for building buildings. 